Hi, this is problem 13 from the 2020 AMC 10A. A frog sitting at the point 1, 2 begins a sequence of jumps where each jump is parallel to one of the coordinate axes and has length 1, and the direction of each jump is chosen independently at random. The sequence ends when the frog reaches a side of the square with vertices 0, 0, 0, 4, 4, 4, and 4, 0. What is the probability that the sequence of jumps ends on a vertical side of the square? All right, this seems tricky. Let's see if we can draw this out. We're going to have a 4x4 four four grid of lattice points. And the problem specifies that there are going to be some vertical ending points on the left side. Call that V. And some horizontal finishing points, top and bottom call that H, and we're starting at point 1, 2. So I noticed from the description, this looks like a random walk process. We're going to make random jumps left or right or up or down. So this looks like two independent random walk processes, one horizontal and one vertical. And so I started thinking, okay, this is like a random walk. Started pulling out uh, my Pascal triangle, try to help sort that out. But about one minute into this, I realized this is going to take quite a bit more computation than I estimated. And it didn't really match up with the, uh, the difficulty of a typical problem 13 on an AMC 10A. So at that point, I took a step back and tried to look at this problem with a little bit of wishful thinking. And I noticed that uh, five of these points are symmetrically located relative to the vertical and the horizontal finishing points. So the probability starting from any of these symmetric points is quite easy to calculate. It's going to be one half for the vertical ending point and one half for the horizontal ending point. So I also noticed that I'm only one step away from one of these symmetric points. Our starting location can either end up on a vertical finishing point or one of these symmetric points on the very first jump. So this suggests that a probability tree is the, is the correct way to go. So starting with our starting point, there's a one quarter chance that we could finish on the very first jump, which is going to make a jump to the left. And there's a three quarter probability that we're going to end up on a symmetric point, which is easy to calculate. And from the symmetric point, there's a one half probability of ending up on a vertical and a one half probability of ending up on the horizontal and calculating the uh, the gross probability of ending up on a vertical, it's uh, one quarter plus three quarters times one half. That's uh, one quarter plus three eighths. That's uh, five eighths for choice B.